welcome everybody and welcome back to those who've been here before. Thanks for coming back again. Today we have the Evite uh, Independence Day box of awesomeness. Uh, looks like we got a pretty good sized box here, 18 pounds. So kind of mid-weight. There's some little, I've heard of a little lighter, like 14-ish and one of my teammates got a 35 pound box that was a giant sniper rifle. But uh, we got 18 pounds and a pretty good sized box. Looks like there's probably, eh, maybe there's not two rifles in here because this one had the plate carrier with it. So maybe that's why it's a little extra big. But without further ado, let's get in here and see what we got. We open it at today with the Glock mag from the WE Galaxy we got out of the Airsoft GI pistol box. Not a bad little gun. Cisco must know I like gold or something. We did get a pistol. SAI, oh boy. Hold that down so everybody can see my beautiful face here. Oh, you're gonna wanna open. All right, it looks like the SAI Blue, uh, the AEP. I think these things are based on like the SEMA AEPs. But uh, I've actually got the um, Salient Arms slide on one of my uh, Gen 4 Humorex blocks. Not bad. A little lighter than the, uh, I don't know, this one's in this gas? Oh, this is a gas SAI blue. All right. Huh. I figured for sure this was one of the AEP ones because that's what they've been giving away like crazy in the last few boxes. But this is actually a green gas SAI blue. All right. I like it. All right. Let's see, I think our card's in here too. Oh, look at that. How fitting. We even got the Ace of Diamonds, which has the SAI blue on it. And we have Meowica. I'll have to give that to the girlfriend. She's more of a cat fan. I'm a dog guy myself. All right. There's the plastic. What else do we got in the box there? Oh, it actually it comes with uh, the raised suppressor sights. Are those? Those kind of look like nice sights, too. Those almost look like either fiber or I assume they got to be fiber optic. If they were trading, they'd be more expensive than the gun. And what else do we have in here? little grip logos. I assume those would go on like a 19 or 11 or something like that where you get the little circle in the middle of the grip. Beretta M9, any of those type of guns where you got a little circular logo in the middle of the grip that you can put a little uh, little emblem. Or a little, I don't know if we can get it up there close enough to focus. We got some little eagles. Yeah, not bad. I assume that's most of the accessories that came in the box besides the plate carrier that's supposed to be in here. Random piece of plastic. Real plate carrier in here. I'm pretty sure they were all supposed to come with that Independence Day plate carrier. Great, we have the FN Herstel Scar little starter kit. Um, 
yeah, these things are generally just not very good. Uh, any anytime you see soft air, it's uh, definitely definitely a spring powered pistol, and I would assume a spring powered rifle. Um, let's see here. Ugh. People made plastic wrap. See, I see a I see a wall charger. This must be one of the uh, oh yeah battery in the uh, magazine. Yep, gravity fed through the sight. Oh yeah, yeah full um full rifle with the uh, with the battery um, weighs uh, about as much as that SAI pistol. Um, <laughs> Definitely, definitely a you know a cool little starter plinking around in the backyard or whatever. But uh, but yeah, definitely not something that you'd actually use on the field. And somewhere in here, oh there we go, a beautiful all polymer Springer Scar pistol. Oh there we go. It actually has a functioning safety. It just doesn't stop the trigger. It actually, actually feels a little better quality than some of the Springer pistols I've seen before, but uh, definitely not exactly something that um, you're going to be fielding anytime soon. Alright, let's get that back in the box and see what's hiding in the bottom. They included those with a couple of decent guns since they weren't a high value one on their own. Nope. We got a, another tan Colt Polymer M4. This uh, makes the third one in the last three boxes. Uh, thanks for that, Evike. I think we're just going to leave this right in the, uh, the plastic. Um, who knows? Maybe that'll be a little giveaway. We're at like 70 something subs right now. I'll tell you what, when we hit 100. We're gonna give that sucker away to somebody. So uh, don't forget to do the like, share, and subscribe thing to, to get in on that. Anybody that's a, uh, that's a sub at 100 subscribers, we're just gonna give this sucker away. How's that sound? Not a, not a great box, um, you know, in my opinion. Um, I'm sure value-wise, you know, it still adds up to, to more than the 200 bucks for the box by a pretty good measure, because those SAI pistols are, you know, like 180. So, you know, even if this thing was worth 20 bucks, you're already pretty much back to the value of the gun or the box. But, uh, but yeah, not exactly a real exciting one in my opinion, for sure. Um, but hey, it'll be great for you guys because that's something we can give away. Uh, these things actually aren't really too too bad. They're just they're definitely a budget beginner gun. Um, you know, I wouldn't throw a lipo or anything in it because you're probably going to shred the gearbox. But, uh, but yeah, it, it handles a 9.6 with a with a fairly respectable rate of fire for a nickel metal battery. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, not not the most exciting box for sure out of Evite. But hey, you win some, you lose some. Definitely got a base box this time. But what can you do? Everybody's got to uh, take a base box for the team every now and then. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to uh, like, share, subscribe. You know the drill. And we'll uh, see you next time. We got the uh, Airsoft GI version 4 box coming. Bought a second one. And yeah, Daddy hooked, Cisco hooked me up the last time, so I figured I'd, I gotta show him some love and order another one. Um, and we have the Cisco Private Collection box coming. Somehow I hadn't noticed that on the, uh, on the Airsoft GI store before, but that was only a $200 like their regular boxes, so figured we'd better give that a try, see if Cisco sends us some spicy mail. Alright guys, have a great day. Thanks for watching.